Jess, Senate Bill 287 looks to modify current abortion law so women could face punishment for receiving an abortion. Right now, the law only targets doctors and those who help those abortions be carried out. Senate Bill 287 was filed by Republican State Senator Warren Hamilton of McCurtain. The legislation takes out a key exception from Oklahoma's abortion law. Note the line drawn that crosses out this section, which protects women from being charged or convicted of any criminal offense in the death of her unborn child. Now this bill is just that, a bill. It would need to pass through both chambers of the legislature where it has many opponents. If it makes it to the governor's desk, he has previously committed to signing pro life legislation. I promised Oklahomans that I would sign every piece of pro-life legislation that hit my desk. But he tells me a law like Senate Bill 287 goes too far. Would you sign a bill like that? Uh, no, we're not going to punish uh, women in the state of Oklahoma. That's that's preposterous. Uh, we want to protect moms and we want to protect babies in Oklahoma. We've been very clear about that, uh, but we'll look at all those bills. There's a lot of stuff that's filed this year. There's actually 3,000 that our policy team is uh, going through in depth right now. And coming up this Sunday at 10 p.m. on KOCO 5, we'll have an extended interview with the governor. We talk about education as well as tax reform, as well as what he wants to see for inflation relief and teacher pay raises. All of this ahead of his State of the State address set for Monday.